Right. Just get a cop car from the police station. Piss off. Truck. And I bet you any money that cop car over there is locked. Okay. Makes a change. I'm going to leave it here and hope for the best. Hoping that took out a couple of those uh, soldiers. It took out one of them anyway. Oh, great. <sighs> I've got no choice but to just make my own way back to the police station. Because it seems that any vehicle you bring to this mission vanishes. Well, most of the time anyway. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. It's not fair, honestly. Hmm. Jesus. Well, if you think I'm parking a helicopter right in front of the cafe, you're wrong. Using the van, I'm using a cop car. Oh, that hasn't happened in a while. That's not a good sign. I'm hoping that was just a one off. I really hope so. Okay, so it's good to know. If you park a vehicle right outside the cafe, it won't disappear. Interesting. So I'll get a cop car in that case. Not that one, nope. One from the police station. Leave it. Stop. Stop. Please. Stop. Enough. Jesus. I think my cop car is... Oh, it's still there. Good. Oh! One health. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, bugger off. Get out of the way mission failed text. Okay, 
and make a mad dash back. I'm not having it, actually. Come on. Get yourself over here. Die. Fucking die. Just do it. I just did kill you. Truck, don't worry about it. Hope it's still there. The cop car. It is. Oh, help. Ah, come on. No! I have only picked up the Cubans once. Once I have picked them up. This is harder than, than the chase. It really is. No doubt about it. Or have I picked them up more than once? For the life of me, I can't remember. So much shit has happened. I can't keep up anymore. Yes, of course, one fucking tire gets popped! One more go, and then I'm gonna move on to Mr. Black's missions. Back tire as well, that's worse. So those soldiers are accurate as shit. As Phil Collins would say, I don't care anymore. I'm gonna head over to Ocean View, save there, and do Mr. Black's missions. Oh dear, Megacop didn't spawn properly that time, did he? Right, same strategy. Go in the alley. To get away from the tank. I mean the hunter, sorry. Oh, 
Right. Payphone time, let's go. Guess I'll leave it over here. Come on. Oh great, they got out. Ah, oh, this isn't good, guys. This isn't good. Well, for I've I've done enough. Okay, I've done enough. Hopefully, I'll see you in the next recording session. Thanks for watching. Stay solid and don't let cannon fodder or the uh, returning game crashes bite. Now I'm not so sure that my save file was ever corrupted. I think in this recording session I just got lucky. Okay folks, so this is uh, yet another extra recording session because part 14 was a bit short. Now, um, Hollywood Jack, the creator of the, hello, Seven Stars mod, has uh, given me some uh, very interesting information. Um, he reckons that it's not a good idea to save when you have seven stars, so that could very well be causing these crashes. So from now on, what I'm going to do is lose my seven stars before saving. And he also said I should wait for the hunter to fly away and then save. Also, Skeet has told me that... Oh, Jesus. After all that. Yeah. Hold on a minute. You may have noticed that at several points in this playthrough, the army vehicles take a long time to turn up. Skeet has told me that you can rectify that by simply committing a crime, such as stealing a vehicle or firing a gun. And that makes sense because I do remember... when I did the Seven Stars Challenge right at the end of my GTA 3 Six Stars playthrough. God. Whoa! <laughs> nice one! <laughs> what are the chances? Wow! I know something that's going in the highlight reel. Jesus. See, so, sorry, um, when I did the Seven Stars Challenge during the final part of my GTA 3 Six Stars playthrough, I noticed that um, in order to make the Black Patriots turn up, you have to commit a crime, such as uh, firing a gun. And, um, with the Seven Stars mod in this game, it's no exception. Except doing that makes the trucks and tanks turn up. But the Hunter always comes along regardless. But thanks Skeet and thanks Hollywood Jack. Also, um, I reloaded a backup save again and redid the film studio and Kaufman Cabs missions. Well done. Uh, should I get more armor? So yeah, from now on, I'm not going to save when I have seven stars.
I'm going to lose my 7 stars first. But I don't know if I should uh, use the lose wanted level cheat to do that, or just go to a pain spray. I'm really not sure. Also, I wouldn't mind having a, a melee weapon. Oh, oh Christ. I don't know. I need to go back and save. But I don't know if I should lose my water level by going to a pain spray. I reckon you guys won't mind if I just, uh... Use the wanted level cheat to clear my stars. Um... So I can't decide. die already. I think I'll just use the lose wanted level cheat before I save. Give me the extra challenge of uh, trying to get to my safe house with seven stars. Yeah. And then again, getting to a pain spray with seven stars is challenging too. Especially without a tank. Oh, and again. <laughs> I'm not sure how the hunter got destroyed right there. Right, uh, okay. Yeah, for now I'll just use the lose one in level cheat. Is it gone? Yeah, he said, Hollywood Jack also said wait 10 seconds for the hunter to fly away. I've... I've uh, copied and pasted slot, I mean, save file 5 onto my desktop, so I have a backup of a backup save. So I'll just save over it. Anything that helps to stop these infernal game crashes, you know? Right, time for Waste the Wife, and then I'll do Auto Side. You guys can vote, should I use the Lose Wanted level cheat to clear my 7 stars just before I save, or should I use the Pain Sprays? Let me know what you think. To be honest with you, it's probably six and a half a dozen. Right, for Waste the Wife, same strategy that I used in my six stars playthrough. I'll use a tank to kill Mrs. Dawson, but not the cannon. If you ram her car with a tank, she'll die, and you won't fail the mission. But if you use a cannon, you will fail because that is a weapon. Right, I need to turn around. Okay, the magic disappearing tank. Come on, get off. Go away, officer. Auto side should be straightforward. I can just use a tank to kill most of the targets. I'll have to snipe Mike Griffin and uh, Nick Kong though. Easy peasy. Right, back to Ocean View and save there, but first I'll lose my seven stars.
Whoa! <laughs> to infinity and beyond. Right. Gone, I think. I'm not sure I can get back in that tank. Okay. All right, one more mission, and then I'll come off auto side. More armor would be a good idea right now. I'll pick some up while I'm here. Oh, piss stain. I'm not looking forward to the final mission for Mr. Black, Loose Ends. Especially when I'm uh, on the roof of the ice cream factory. I mean, I might be able to use a tank for... Oh, Christ. I might be able to use a tank for some of that mission. Knob job. <laughs> Holy hell, Hunter. Triple H. Ow. I won't lie, that was a bloody good shot. I'm still alive. Silver PCJ is dead. And so am I. <laughs> oh. I was just about to click the yes button to reload and it's crashed. Glorious. So I'm not 100% sure, but I think the game crashed as soon as I tried to reload my save. It's never done that before. I'm gonna get fuck's sake. Right, can I get a tank? Yes, I can. Whoa. Oh. Yeah, we're good. Got my tank, let's go. Oh, 
piss off. No, you're not boxing me in. Right. God. For a second I thought I got blown up. Well, in a tank. Oh great, they got out. Right. I'm just going to leave the weapons, I don't need them. I'll just use the rocket launcher to kill Mike Griffin. Peter Griffin. <laughs> What's that tank going to do? Nothing. Good shot. On the topic of game crashes and uh, seeing Ken Rosenberg's office back there. I remember many years ago playing this game on the PS2 I decided to see what would happen if you enter the destroy all vehicles cheat during the uh, I poke my head out of the gutter cutscene at the very start of the game. Yep, it crashed alright. I'm sure I read somewhere that um, when you're playing Psycho Killer and if the Psycho's Sentinel gets destroyed or flipped upside down during the uh, Love Fist Ruined My Life cutscene, the game will also crash. I'm hoping that crash that occurred when I tried to reload my game is just a one-off. <clears throat> Alright, Hunter, I think I get the message. And as soon as this mission is over, I'll head straight back to Ocean View and save. Because I know the next mission for Mr. Black is at the airport. And there are save points that are closer. But I just want to save at the hotel in case it crashes. Because game, I know what you're like with this mod. I think we all know what it's like by now. I wonder, can I use the tank's cannon to destroy the yacht from here? I have never tried that. Nah, it just, just goes right over it. Where's the hunter? Um, okay, the tanks are alright. Nick Kong has that sinking feeling. What do you get when you cross a fisherman and a skunk? Hook, line and stinker. Right, where the hell is Charlie going? Candy Mountain, Charlie. He's not far from Ocean View. He's seen me. Has he got x-ray vision or something? Oh, you... 
bastard. I hope you get hit by an AI tank, mate. I think he almost did, actually. Right, I'll stop doing fucking laps around the block. So you're back on the block, huh? I am not leaving this tank. There. That wraps up that extra recording session. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Stay solid. And don't let the hunter bite, as always. Until next time, take care. In the next recording session, I will hopefully finish off Mr. Black's missions. Oh. See you again soon.